afternoon all. Um, update on uh, on the running scenario just before showing you a quick uh, quick video. Uh, a little bit of good and bad, I suppose, in some ways to be expected. Uh, uh, the last update I gave was uh, a real encouraging one. Um, but I was pleased with my form and I'd managed, uh, I think it was four one minute sessions. Uh, that had improved to, to five one minute sessions and uh, again feeling equally good. I, you know, you'd be able to judge for yourself in a second, but it, it, it did feel like actual fun. Um, you'll notice from the video as well, it's on the, the, the curved, self propelled um, treadmill. Uh, supposedly to improve your form, you can be the judge. Uh, I think it does look like running. I could do with being a little bit more upright, uh, higher knee lift, um, and probably a little bit of a faster cadence. Maybe the, the self-propelled friction element might slow that down, but who knows. Anyway, that's a little bit of nitpicking. But you also know I'm wearing um, five and five fingers. Uh, the reason I highlight that is because not long after that, I started getting a little bit of a problem with my foot. Uh, there is a, a recognised condition with uh, within brain injury recovery, uh, something called foot drop. Uh, it's where, well for me, it's just on my right foot, where it position it sort of lands um, in a more exaggerated pronated position, or rather just hangs down and is not engaged with the. Um, and they're the external uh, or lateral muscles of the, the, the lower limb, probably principally anterior tibialis. Um, anyway, uh, that, that's been presenting all along, and I've sort of had um, you know an, uh, an awareness of all not being great with, uh, with, with my foot you know, from almost day one of me being on my feet after, the, um, after post op. Uh, I suppose it was day 14, right, really, or thereabouts. Um, yeah, so that that's presented and it's sort of like stopped me running and uh, it's tracks. I could try to to soldier through it, but one, my technique would be compromised from it, and that would just be a dickhead thing to do, let's be honest. Uh, so, me running has taken a little bit of a hit. Uh, I'm trying to do a bit more climbing as a result, um, but just cracking on with the, the training. Almost as per usual. Uh, again, after, after that milestone session, uh, continued rapid improvement all around, then had a little bit of a crash. Um, maybe, uh, you know, that's what follows a peak. Um, maybe it's because I sort of picked picked up a little bit of a bug. Or maybe it's because I was out in the lash uh, on a couple of days on the bounce. And then, you know, sometimes they can correlate with a crash. And in my case, it did. So, uh, you know, been off the AL for <laughs> for a week or so now, and um, hopefully getting back to the to where it was. Uh, a couple of days in the gym, sort of post, uh, you know, the the illness, um, a bit of a bug, you know. Um, I mentioned there, uh, and seems to be getting back on it now. Like so, I'll see if I can uh, even keep out the AL for a. Uh, a few days or so and uh, see if we get back on it but running is stalled unfortunately for now um, we'll see when we can get back onto it because I would like to, to smash that mile before um, before me one year up of this um, alright that's enough I'll um, I'll tag the, the treadmill uh, video on the end of this